Good morning, Maple Shade School, and welcome to this Friday's segment of Maple Shade News. And we have an exciting group of fifth graders here. Let me introduce them to you. Say hello, Arthur. Hello. Say hello, Elizabeth. Hi. And say hello, Aza. Hi. So the reason why I have them here is because in fifth grade, we are learning about archery. And I have a bow here from Mrs. Hodge's physical education class, and she's teaching our fifth graders how to be expert, well, maybe not quite expert, but really good at archery. And I'd like each of you to tell me a little bit about how you've enjoyed this and what you've learned. So go ahead, Arthur. Um, I really enjoyed this because, well, I like weapons. Okay. And it's very safe because there's such, oh yeah, you have to be very particular. Very particular, a lot of care, yeah. right, and yeah. careful. And Mr. Carey's in there helping you guys every class too as well, yeah. right? So go ahead, Elizabeth. What would you like to say about it? Um, I like how it's like like safe, like like Arthur said, and I think it's just fun, like how you can shoot wherever you want, like at the target. It is fun, isn't it? And go ahead. What about you, Aza? I really like the satis satisfaction of when an arrow hits the target, and I also like talking to whoever's next to me about their experiences with archery. And I was in your class today, and I think all three of you are getting very, very good at hitting that target, right? So, Elizabeth, do you mind showing us all the steps it takes to be a safe and good archer? Sure. Your all right. foot has to be a little bit, like, angled. And the next step is knock, which, like, you grab your arrow, like, downward, and then you put it, like, on. And there's a little green clip, so you have to clip the arrow under the green clip and then you rest it on this metal piece and then um, it's draw handset so you get three fingers and then you just rest it on here I mean like under the arrow and then you do bow handset which you just grab this thing and then if you do pre-draw you just like bring it up and then when you draw you just pull back and like the next step is anchor so you put it like right here and then you have to aim and then shot setup so you just make sure that everything's like done like just check everything you've done and then release and then follow through and reflect wow sounds like you guys all have this down and you're very very proficient at being archers and i like that game you were playing today that you had to hit 21 but you couldn't go over 21 and you had three arrows to do it I think you all did a very, very good job in class, and you have an exciting experience in archery. That is wonderful. And Aza, we have a birthday, don't we? Yes, happy birthday to Anthony Sowers. That's great, and we will do our Pledge of Allegiance. Mm -hmm. and I pledge, pledge allegiance to, to the flag of the United States, States of America, America and, and to the republic for which it stands, one, one nation, nation, under God, God indivisible, with, with liberty and justice, and justice for all. Okay, thank you very much, Maple Shade, and enjoy your weekend.